what is up everyone welcome back uh today we're going to be busting open 2019 uh tops gypsy queen uh my 2020 i ordered uh got back ordered or they sold too many and they didn't um they couldn't get it to me so the price <laughs> the price went up it's going up like 10 bucks a day so uh switched over still uh you know a good box um you know definitely uh not on the cheaper side but uh we got 2019 gypsy queen we're looking for uh pete alonzo vlad Bo Alvarez, Tatis, you know, Jimenez, all the all the good ones. Along with, uh, we can get two on-card autos, on-card, per box, which is great. Um, so let's just go ahead and crack this open. I'm excited about this. Um, if you watched my Donruss video or any of the other baseball videos, you know that I uh, was saying how I didn't fairly represent baseball on this channel. I got too excited, taste, uh, started chasing down too many uh, basketball inserts. And then I was doing a bunch of baseball when I first started getting back into the hobby, but um, I was doing it all before I started the channel. So uh, stepping up our game, we got a lot more baseball coming up. Uh, some really, really great uh, boxes coming in. So I'm excited, very excited for this. So let's just go ahead and let's uh, get into uh, 2019 Gypsy Queen. So here's three Chrome cards. We'll save that for last. Uh, great looking uh, box. Some people hate the look of these cards. Uh, I personally like them. I, I don't know. I just like the changes of the monot monotony. Uh, if you watch um, Don Russ Frakes or things like that, you know that uh, if you <laughs> would you rather have these, or would you rather have 2020 Don Russ base cards? So uh, let's just go ahead and break into this. We'll see what we get. We're excited. Not sure if the odds are here. Yeah. So there's that. If anyone uh, stumbles upon this and wants to see uh, one day, and we are off. So. Did do a 2020 Donruss, like I just said. Uh, doing 2005 Donruss Classics, where we can get uh, some really big autos out of there. So I'm excited. Um, I know that it's like more like artsy, but I like it. There's a nice uh, Frankie Lindor. And the card stock feels good. Like, you know, a lot of these new cards are feeling real flimsy. Uh, Trevor Bauer right there. So I, I actually, there's a nice Bryce Harper. I actually like these cards. I get it. It looks like it's not like a real picture of the player, but it is. It's just, uh, you know, some of that Photoshop magic, but get some nice cards. And like I said, the, the weight is, feels right. Something about those new lighter cards are uh, throwing me off a little bit, so. Uh, but really uh, happy for this break, excited. I uh, got it. I think I got a good deal in this box. We'll see, we'll see what kind of autos we get. That'll really, that'll really tell us, right? So there's a good rookie right there. Uh, Luis, let's see, Josh Harder, and, uh, Frammel, Frammel's good, but, uh, yeah, so we did a lot of breaks, um, doing, uh, we did, um, also order, uh, Top Stadium Club Chrome, we got 98 Bowman, which I know is weird, but I'm kind of just snatching up old hobby boxes, um, in order to, uh, that's a nice one. In order, there's Glaber Torres. I like this card a lot as well. Uh, so, Ten of Swords. I haven't seen the... There's Edwin Encarnacion. He used to actually be on my fan team back in the day. So, um, I haven't broken this box before. So, these are cool little tarot cards. But, um, so I'm basically snatching up old hobby boxes from all over. So, and there's uh, Jake Lamb. Uh, so, you know, obviously some like this. Uh, but, you know, if you can get a great deal, like I'm finding some great deals on random hobby boxes that still have great hits in them so even if there weren't big rooks and uh, but we can still get like ken griffey inserts we can still get a lot of really cool uh there's a, a a lot of really cool uh there's bregman d gordon i liked him uh autos and things like that it's like why not you get them for at a great price so i'm not sure how i feel about these little cards i feel like they're just gonna be a pain in the butt but you know i guess they're different so you know beggars can't be choosers i like different but I do like the way they feel. I think some cards do look better than others, so there's no question about that. But uh, no big, uh, big 2019 rooks yet. No hits yet, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. There's Zach Grinky. Like that player a lot. Uh, Salvador Perez. Okay, so no name on the front of this. Zach uh, Wheeler. Um, actually, not familiar if that's like a misprint or something. So I'll set that aside. I'll sleeve it up later. Just in case, probably is. There's a uh, Brandon Lowe and Steven Strasberger. Uh, so I'll sleeve it up later. My my assumption is that it totally is a misprint. Um, 
So, you know, misprints, people like their, the error cards. So we'll always sleeve those up. And most of these cards, well, most, all these cards go into books or sleeves. Uh, other than like really brutal commons, there's David Price. Uh, they just, uh, there's another Frammel. They go into uh, a box, big box. So pretty cool. I like the packs. They look pretty cool. Uh, I'm still going to get 2020 uh, Gypsy Queen. Just um, I'm going to wait till they cool their jets on the pricing. Because right now it was originally like, you know, around 100 bucks. There's Ryan O'Hearn. Uh, then it went up to 110, 120, 130. Now it's going for one. There's you Darvish, 179. Uh, looks like here's a blue parallel for us. So that's nice. Uh, it is numbered, so it's out of uh, 250. It's number 30. So keep that there, like those uh, numbered cards. Um, looks like maybe just the parallels, but uh, so we'll get it. But it's going for like 279 dollars right now. So uh, no thanks. You know, don't be wrong. Like it's, it's just the demand. You know, I think more people are at home watching breaks or collecting cards themselves. So it's getting out of control. Uh, there's Justice Sheffield. That's a good one. Snell's another good one. Here's an Aaron Judge fortune card, fortune teller card. So they're cool. They're different, but I, I'm not, uh, I don't like the size at all. Um, but you like the, like the cardstock. I think I get why Donruss, uh, did that, why they printed the cardstock like that, because then they have like a bajillion parallels <laughs> that they could just run through a different printer, but, uh, they, they don't feel right. So Jose Martinez, there's Nimmo, Jack, uh, Jackie Bradley Jr., and uh xavier uh borgat so uh sorry for butchering your name buddy uh two of wands it's interesting because the other one didn't say that um all right and no one uh no other big rook so uh one stack out of three down there we go that was nice it's nice packs on screen there Let's try to rip through this pretty quickly i know it's a hobby box but you know, and we we're actually haven't gotten an audio yet, so we'll see. There's Joey Votto, Juan Soto, like that one a lot too. Uh, another fortune teller right here is another Snell. So I'll have to figure out, maybe I could put two in one sleeve. I'm not sure. And Freddie Freeman, and did, was there another loose card in there? No. Thought I felt another little card. So Noah uh, on uh, card auto yet. So, and we haven't really pulled any of the big, big time rookies. So I'm uh, really hoping that you know, we get, we get uh, makeup and we get the combination of the two. So let's see. There's Yachty, Matt Boyd, and Travis Shaw, and Jake Powers. So no one yet. Still got plenty of packs, but um, ordered a, I think I'm chasing down uh, Jeter's Rook. So it's like, is like trout like that it's like a great time for this and a, a horrible time because a lot of small bit i mean we luckily we have online but still a lot of these local card shops that's an interesting uh gypsy queen right there steven duggar oh this is our auto <laughs> that's why hello so there's our uh there's our on card auto right there so that was our first hit sweet uh grab our penny sleeves over here but yeah it's a hard time for uh small businesses small card shops um you know not, not all of them operate, uh, if you have any in your local town that you like because they don't, uh, they don't, uh, you know, jack up the prices. It's probably because they don't do a ton online. So like in my town, there's a few, so it's tough. A lot of these places are, uh, going under and having to sell lots of, of cards and things like that. So, you know, you can get, if you, if you're savvy and you take your time online, You'll, you can get good prices. Uh, obviously, there's other people just jacking up the prices if you're looking right now at the time of this video. So uh, let's go, buddy. I want to do anything to you. So there's our first hit, Steven Duggar, San Francisco Giant. Uh, so I hate this card because I'm a Dodger fan. No, I'm just kidding. But still, if you want that card, uh, hit me up and we do our next giveaway. If you win, you can have it. <laughs> so, um, but let's just go ahead. Did we go through these? Brandon, Brandon Bell. Yeah. So that's one of our two hits. Uh, the cards look beautiful. I actually love the card, these cards with the auto. Like for some reason, it just looks uh, looks really nice. So I think something looks strange about that card. Um, okay, there's a uh, Michael Brantley, Shohei Otani. Nice. So he's on the front. 
Uh, really happy to get this Shohei Otani card. It was one of the uh, one of the cards I was looking for. So, penny sleeve him real quick. And I guess the cardstock also being a little thicker, at least for me, feels like more secure. Like it's not going to get dinged up as easy. So sweet. So we're doing. Uh, we got a hit. Uh, well, we got a couple hits, but so far I like that Shohei Otani and that uh, Frankie Lindor. Uh, Zach Wheeler right there. So yeah. So there's his. Uh, I guess it is a misprint. So no name Zach Wheeler over there. And we'll have to move some of these fortune teller cards. So still plenty of packs. One more hit to go. Would like a Vlad. Definitely like a Pete Alonso. Uh, starting, starting to pull Polar Bear here and there, but uh, it's few and far between. So love for us to make up and he can just hit me this uh, autograph real quick. This is Bo Jackson. So the throwback cards they put in here. That's cool. And Justin Turner. So like that card. I'm a Dodger fan. So all about that. All about those Dodgers. Uh, go blue. Bleed blue. And if you're watching this and you like some other team, it's fine. As long as you're not a Giants fan. Uh, so then there. Just kidding. You're all welcome. There's Robinson Cano. And there's uh, Lorenzo Gain. All right. We're down to almost one stack left. One more auto to go, three Chrome cards, and no Pete Alonzo, no Vlad, no Keston Hira. Um, there's another Clayton Kershaw. I'm getting plenty of Clayton Kershaw. Ronald Cunha Jr., nice. So, wanted this card. Uh, all about that. So, definitely still collecting Ronald Cunha Jr. at this point, uh, no matter what year it is. So, that's fantastic. Take that. Boom. Right there. And we'll just keep chugging along here. Uh, followed up by uh, Justin Smoke. Smoke. All right. This is our last pack for the second stack, and then we'll be on to our uh, our third one. Maybe we'll get our uh, our next hit. So, all right. Victor Robles, Adam Eaton. There's another food, fortune teller card. So this is Freddie Freeman. Um, and there's Polanco. So I do like the cards. I mean, definitely they've made their own mark with the Gypsy Queen. I don't know if I'd go back like specifically for Gypsy Queen. I just really wanted to break 2019 and 2020 Gypsy Queen. So I'm going to do that. But after this, I'll probably uh, pivot to... Uh, there's Francisco Mejia, Salvador Perez. I'll probably pivot to uh, a couple other different sets. So really love chasing those autos, uh, which is nice. So I'm starting, to, I'm starting to hone in on like older boxes too from like the mid uh, 2000s. Where, like, the hits are okay, prices are okay, but you can still get, like, the opportunity for an auto is obviously tough, but there's a couple guarantees, and there's some older players in there, which is cool. Evan Longoria was on my fan team for a long time, favorite player. Um, and then Cody Bellinger, got a cool uh, numbered uh, card of his recently. Those Donruss packs, they look, the, the base card looks blasé because they print all those parallels on them. But so much going on in those packs. And then, like, they're thin. And then they're, the way that they do their graphics, I missed, like, three <laughs> three numbered cards. Paul Goldschmidt. Uh, when I was doing my break. And there's our, there's our second hit. So Carson Kelly is our second hit right there. Um, On-card auto. I do like the fact that it is an on-card auto. I mean, I'll take... I'd rather take a uh, sticker auto of, like, Pete Alonso, but... Still, uh, I do the on card autos are something a little, it's small stuff, right? It's a little like more detail. You know that this person had this card was like, whoosh, there you go. So let's go ahead and top load our other auto. And then we got a whole, oops, just open that box, whole another stack to go. And we'll see, uh, see who we can get out of here. So, um, doing all right. We got a Ronald Cudi Jr. We got Bryce Harper. We got Trout. We got Frankie Lindor. Uh, we got Shoei Otani. So I'm feeling um, feeling pretty good. It's Max Scherzer and Miguel uh, Andor. So. Um, and then we got a blue parallel. So we're getting nice cards. I like that. We're getting like a nice little uh, card collection. So that's great. But, you know, you want the hits. You, you're chasing down rookies. You're chasing down. Uh, there's uh, Manny Machado. Uh, you're chasing down specific players. There's Mookie Betts. So. I know I'm all in on Mookie Betts. I just collect him like crazy because, you know, he's out here in L.A. with us. All right, last three packs. 2019 uh, Gypsy Queen. And 
really have not. I really want a Vlad or a Pete Alonzo out of here. Just one. One or the other. Both will do. Uh, there's uh, Eugenio Suarez. So I like that card. Um, here's Edwin Diaz exit card. Kind of looks kind of cool. Excuse me. Last two packs. And then we have our uh, Chrome pack of three cards. So if you're still hit, uh, here with me along for the ride, uh, we appreciate the uh, subscribe. It helps us grow the channel. Um, you know, we're going to bring you lots more. We do married to different breaks. So uh, really appreciate that. It doesn't cost you anything. And really, there's Miggy helps us out. Roberto, my junior. As far as uh, continuing to uh, do this content and honestly interface just on nothing that's really going to affect you, but just going to help us interface on YouTube. So. Uh, anyways, appreciate that. Let's get back into these last two packs. All right. Last pack. Regular 2019. Tops Gypsy Queen. Uh, there's a Yelly. So I like Yelly. I still collect a bunch of him. Joss Bell. That's a nice one. It's Wade Davis. Come on, baby. Okay. All right. Well, last ditch effort here. So there's our two on-card autos. And here is our Topps Chrome pack. So who are we gonna get? All right, there's Carlos uh, Guerrera, David Peralta, and Miguel Andorra. Okay, blue uh, Topps Chrome. So I actually like this card a lot. Uh, I mean, I like, they look great. The Gypsy Queen in like a tops chrome like mixture kind of i mean it's top sp specific but looks good so this is a nice little hit here and it is numbered i think we saw that when we opened the pack out of 150 it's number 100 and actually i know it sounds really weird but those nice round numbers one five 100 150 out of 150 uh matter uh to buyers so um little little uh, extra detail there for us so that's great so we did get some hits we got some rooks uh, thanks for joining me. We're going to bring you a lot more baseball, and uh, hopefully you'll join us for uh, some future breaks. Bye-bye.